Hey there, it's Bobby Legs and welcome to another episode of Bobby Legs Loves Watches. And today I'll be reviewing the Casio G-Shock GM-2100B-3A, also known as the stainless steel Casio in green. Now this is another G-Shock release, another variation of the quote unquote Casio, a very, very popular series of watches by G-Shock over the last uh, year or two. And this is a stainless steel uh, metallic version. One of my favorites uh, so far that's come out, I, I used to have the blackout version, the resin version, but I found that very hard to read. This one, I found it a little bit easier to read, probably because it's not uh, black on black but there is some contrast with some of the colors. And this green is out of sight. This is the GM2100B-3A. And uh, currently it's out of stock on the G-Shock website. It is listed for $220. There's a, a blue variation and a red variation available in this series here that are, um, that they are available to, to purchase on the site. They'll come back again. Uh, they're very, very popular, this color. Um, so I'm sure uh, G-Shock will restock. So let's let's get into some of the specs. Now, I'm going to interlace this video with a lot of shots, outdoor shots and pictures and video because, you know, the, the, the Casio has been reviewed a bunch of times already, right? Uh, so you may not have been able to see some like real life footage of this particular colorway. And, and so that's what I'm gonna do. It's not gonna be uh, your typical video. I'm not gonna go over the functionality uh, of the watch. You, you know what it is. Uh, if, you, if you don't, uh, like I said, there's other videos out there. But uh, we do have a 49.3 millimeter lug to lug, we'll call it. 44.4 uh, uh, millimeter case diameter, but I measured actually from uh, east to west here, 43.8, 11.8 millimeter case thickness. This is a 200 meter water resistant watch. Let's get a quick weight on it. It's very, very light. Um, they're measuring, they say 70 grams, 72 grams um, on the website. It's I say 74 here. It's, it's probably 72. That's, that's fine. Uh, resin strap. And I, I really like this resin strap. I mean, it almost feels like a, a vinyl in a way, but in a good way. And uh, it just feels really, really good to the touch. Uh, you have this, these um, you know, dimples here, a very, very nice uh, resin keeper, which is excellent. Uh, stainless steel uh, buckle, plenty of holes for adjustment. And uh, I found this watch uh, to be very, very comfortable on wrist, really. Uh, now, you do have some of the main features and functionality that you would have with your, your typical G-Shock. You have uh, here you have 31 time zones, one one hundredth of a second stopwatch, countdown timer, five alarm, five alarms, a calendar. It's plus minus 15 seconds a month, shock resistant, uh, LED light here. And I'll do a, a loom shot. Uh, you can't really see right here. Yeah, there you go. You got LED right here. You do have the the, dis, the digital display as well as the analog hands right here at the nine o'clock position, uh, the date. So today's Monday. That's why it's indicated and the M there. Pretty, pretty cool. Uh, mineral glass, uh, Neo Bright Loom. And you check it out. Uh, the dial is steeped in here to the case. So there is a nice... Um, form of depth, I feel. I really, uh, you know, I really enjoy what what Casio does here with the Casio, and you can see these indices are kind of like, you know, they look like little little chairs. They look almost like uh, like a little spaceship, right, in the inside of it. And everybody sits down. I sit down here, you know. I'm in review. Sit down here. I, you know, <laughs> we all sit down together as, as we blast off. Real silly. Uh, I I know. Um, dark gray IP bezel here. Uh, metal stainless steel uh, the case has this nice little uh, sheen to it the dial is this uh, dark like forest green uh, very very nice color i could see why this was one of the first ones to sell out in this metallica stainless steel series because it is a gorgeous color let me put this on wrist and with typical uh, cassie oak fair 
These watches fit great on my wrist. Six and three quarter inch wrist right here. And man, it is so light. It is so great, so cool. Yeah, easier for me to read than than the uh, the blackout version, as I mentioned earlier. Um, almost forget that it's on wrist. I mean, look at that. Uh, now this watch will fit. I if you're down to like maybe a six and a quarter inch, maybe a six inch wrist. I think it, I think it'll work depending on if you have a flat wrist. Um, but it's awesome. Now the buttons here, as you can see, are stainless steel and they're easy to get to. Some Casios have a problem. Uh, getting into those push buttons uh, to maneuver uh, the functionality uh, that is available to the watch, uh, but uh, not this one. One last thing I want to point out, uh, you do have these like, quick release here uh, for straps. Uh, I would assume uh, the only ones that really will fit here are probably straps made by Casio. I'm hoping for a stainless steel bracelet that will match and conform with this Casio. Man, that would be lights out. I'm waiting for that day. I think it's gonna happen. Uh, I'm hoping that it's gonna happen. I don't know when, but I, I think it's gonna happen because that is such a cool, cool feature. Uh, this is a home run in my opinion. $220 MSRP, like I said, if you can get it, get it, jump on it, set an alert. Um, it's, uh, it's a great watch. Uh, anyway. Please uh, put in the comment below, let me know what you think about this watch and I'll see you guys in the next video. If my channel is new to you and you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe and click that bell icon to get updates when I upload new videos. I love making these videos and I hope you like them too. And also, if you wanna support the channel, please buy me a cup of coffee. The link is in the description. Take care and I'll see you in the next video.